In this tip, I'm going to show you how to add a contact list to a SharePoint team site. Now we need to navigate to the SharePoint team site and we also need to have permissions to add the item here. If we do, we can go to the cog in the top right corner, select that and then select the option add an app from the menu that appears. Now that'll take us to a list of items that we can add here and the easiest way to locate the contact widget is basically to uh, type that in the top here and then do a search and you'll see that we've got the option here for contacts. We simply select that and what we're going to do here is uh, just give that a generic name. You'll see that we also have the option here to go into the advanced options if we want to make more customizations but we're happy and we hit the create button. That will take us to the list and you'll see here that our contacts item has been added here. Right, so our context item has been added to the contents of the site. We select that and that will navigate us to that list and we can now go in and create new items. The contacts list we created will also appear on the left hand side in the quick launch menu and we can always navigate back to it if we need to. So the way that we created a contacts list in a SharePoint team site was provided we had the rights to do so we went up to the cog selected that and then added an app from the menu that appeared and then went through located the contacts uh, web part and then basically added that.